What's up guys? Welcome back to another pickup video. I'm Joe for Gamer Toys and it is mail time. Alright, All right, so I picked up another WWF Hasbro wrestler. I picked up another member of Demolition that I did not have. I know there's three members. Um, I have Smash, right? I believe I have Smash. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is Axe. I don't think it's Crush. So he's got the uh, I'm a slam yo ass action feature, my favorite. You know, paint's all right. It's a little bit chipping on, on the chest straps and his face is a little beat up, but it's awesome. Uh, waist is a little loose, but the price I paid, you can't beat it. So I'm really happy to add another wrestler to the ever-growing collection behind me that's now taking up two shelves. Uh, when I rework this room and I'm gonna have to give them their own dedicated space Put you right there, bruh. All right, that's it for mail time. Let's do these pickups. Let's start right here I got some pretty sweet 90s Disney stuff um, These are the Lion King action figures. They were made by Mattel and I picked up young Simba You can try Rafiki here. He moves his hands which is kind of cool. This movie was just huge, right? I mean, everyone knows The Lion King. It was Disney's biggest movie at the time and it had no humans in it, which is, you know, was a first for them. So these toys were great. This still has the original price tag for $3.99. Two figures for $3.99. That would never happen today. But uh, on the back, this is a fairly small line. There was, Mufasa, Scar, and Adult Simba, which were packaged individually. And then there were three two-packs, Timon and Pumbaa, uh, Banzai and Zazu, and Young Simba, and Rafiki. So there's only six, you know, six card backs to collect for this line. So I figured I'd give it a go. I got two already. So that's Simba and Rafiki. And then I also picked up Fighting Action Adult Simba. He's got a try me button here. So his legs move. I paid 10 bucks for this one and I paid, I think seven bucks for this one. I like the card backs. I like how each card back has a different picture. So this one's got Rafiki's tree and then this one has Pride Rock on the back, which is cool. I see these packages and I, I just get hit with nostalgia and it's awesome. And I love 90s Disney and I love 80s Disney as well. They're just, there weren't a lot of action figures made for the older movies like there were, uh, for Aladdin and Lion King and Pocahontas and all those have action figure lines. Moving right along. So bam, we got some turtles again. Bam. Bam. Running out of room. Shabam, shabam. Um, I picked up the four samurai turtles. Leonardo, the Raphael, the Donatello, and the Michelangelo. Uh, these figures are great. Let's just use Leo here. The detail on these samurai suits is amazing. Yeah, there's not a lot of paint apps, but the sculpting is great. I want to say it's the same, the same body used for every turtle, you know, but just a different color green for the skin because the suits look exactly the same. So I'm going to go with yes. The helmets are different and the face mask is the same. And then of course the weapons are different. So the Raf, Raf's probably my favorite, but that's just who I'm drawn to. He was my favorite as a kid. And then we got Donatello who comes with like a mace. It's crazy, like a bow staff with some spikes on it. These figures are just great. Uh, they remind me of that Samurai Leonardo from the vintage line that I had as a kid. Uh, so I had to pick these up too. Great figures. So these are the pickups. I wanna thank you guys for watching. Um, we got, you know, the four Samurai Turtles, some Lion King and a uh, Hasbro WWF wrestler who I believe is Axe. I could be wrong. I'm sure one of you will correct me. I believe it's Axe. Uh, so thanks for watching guys. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.